Hey guys, and welcome to the channel. Uh, real quick, I am right now working on organizing my collection. So what I'm up to is putting things into a system, or into, into the computer. That way I know what I have in my collection. And I thought, you know what? I have all my recent, last few months of um, green light finds, green machines. So I decided, you know what, I'm going to show them off. So you guys know what I have in my collection. Now these are not for trade, so please don't ask. I know some people are going to be asking. Um, so let's get a closer look at what I got. Uh, these, some of these were already seen on Instagram, so if you've seen them on Instagram, um, some of them I posted, some of them I haven't. But here is the HD Truck Series number one. Uh, International Durastar flatbed. I think I did a video on this. Um, it was a random case I bought. And uh, this was in there and I was really excited about that. Um, I don't know if I ever showed them that video or not. Next is the Hot Pursuit. Ford Police Interceptor from series number 21. Uh, this one was an in-store find, which was really fun. Um, somebody beat me to the pegs, but I still managed to find that one. Uh, it, it, was, it was a very nice day for that one. And this one here, too. This one was actually on a busy day um, around the holiday season, I think. Was it? I, I don't recall. Well, this one is from series number 20, the uh, 2016 Police Interceptor Utility. This one... Was I, this one might be one of the older ones? Uh, don't recall. Here's a more recent one. It's a hitch and toe, right here. Hitch and toe uh, series 10, 70s Ford F100. This one was a morning find, I think. I don't recall, but that one was hanging on the pegs on the front. And um, next here, this is a recent one, I think, from last month, was it? No, I'm sorry. This one was late August. But it was a pretty cool find uh, moments after. I found several things that day. Moments after, a guy walked up on me. And um, I ended up uh, leaving the area. <laughs> I was like, screw this. I was out. Next is a 1991 Ford Mustang. Uh, this find here was a recent one. Um, I forgot what it was. Oh, it was a Toys R Us. Yes, this was a Toys R Us, and uh, this was a Toys R Us in in an area that I don't go into that often. But when I do, um, I usually find something I'm looking for if I really need it. And this one was hanging on the pegs. Uh, they had two cases that day because, um, or with that week, something like that. I don't recall if those were actually from that day. But I did not make it in on time for opening. Um, I don't know if I've ever posted a photo from uh, the cash registers. It was Hot Wheels scattered all over the place. Um, and these, one case was on the pegs. The other one was kind of scattered in the aisle. And uh, this one was hanging on the pegs. I don't know if they missed it or they weren't a green light collector. Um, I found a white lightning in that store. My first white lightning, actually. So, uh, to find a green machine here, too, was pretty cool. Um, I don't have too much time because uh, I have a lot of things pre-recorded. This one was one of the more recent finds. Uh, you guys probably don't recall if I posted this video yet or not. Um... But that store is a store that's on lockdown, and you can't find anything in that store. And I managed to find that. I found a white lightning there before, too. Um, my second white lightning, which was a police car. Here is the uh, Godfather um, Hollywood Hitch and Toe. I have two of these. This one is from Hobby Lobby, and the other one I think was Toys R Us, if I'm not mistaken. Um, now that I think about Toys R Us, I, I do have more green machines. Um, I have another Hollywood hitch and toe. I don't know where I put that, though. Um, 
but one of these was found by me the other one was found by the old lady uh, she's a big fan of the godfather so she kept the other one and i got to keep this one fortunate for me <laughs> uh let's see i got two more back here and then we'll get to the larger scale these two are hitch and tells these came out of the same case um, they were freshly pegged, and um, moments after, collectors always seem to uh, show up right after I do. But these are really cool. Uh, look at the difference between the two. Uh, one's older, one's newer, obviously, but very good additions. I do love my green machines. And next... You've probably seen this. This is the most recent find for me. Um, it's funny because um, these here were not supposed to come in. And they ended up coming in. And um, apparently more came in. So I will have to keep my eyes open. And this one is the probably one of the more older ones out of this whole group. But I did manage to find one of the blue wheel variations. I think there was a green wheel variation. I think I got both of them. Um, but that is it. Uh, that's a little look at my recent slash some old green machines. Like I said, I am organizing my collection. That way I know what I have and what I don't have. And I um, decided just to do a video on my green machines that I have currently laying around. I have a lot more. I probably have at least 15 more, if not more. Um, green machines that I just can't get to because either they're in different boxes that are not organized yet but if I do find other things in the near future I will make videos just to show you guys what I have so thank you so much for watching and uh, see you guys later bye bye